Assalamu alaikum ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to my channel. I'm making the same video for my Instagram and for my YouTube. So welcome to my Instagram's IGTV too. Everybody knows that a campaign is going hashtag boycott French products. But there's so less people who don't even know the meaning behind it or the reason behind it. So let me explain. Cutting the story short. A professor tha in France, what did he do? He started showing the portraits of Rasulullah in his class. It was a history professor, I guess. History professor tha, and he started showing the portraits. Astaghfirullah. Astaghfirullah. He started showing the portraits of Rasulullah but then he didn't cut He knows that the community, the Muslim community, is so huge. Hit me. So. A student, tha, he was very courageous, I must say. What did he do? He killed that professor. Uske baad, jo government thi, French government, unko, they got so much angry at the fact that they said that everybody has a liberty of speech. They have liberty. They can do whatever they want. So what if he, what if he show the portraits of Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam? Now we got to know that this is our weak point. We can't be able to protect Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam. In the face of any kind of threat, any kind of threat. What did he say? Like he didn't say this, but I am going to explain to you. That he officially said that print the pictures, the portraits of Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam, and publish them everywhere. Show them on TVs. Put them in the theaters. मतलब everybody should know that how Rasulullah sallallahu alaihi wasallam looks astaghfirullah bhai hum musalman hain humne hame khwab mein aaj tak naseeb hum itne bure hain matlab aise haath nahi kaapte your heart shatters into pieces i don't know ab hai itni gustakhi ke baad koi bhi musalman ye cheez bardasht nahi kar sakta and i have seen only two famous personalities coming up and saying something against him. Who those two personalities are? Mr. Tayyip Ertagan and the Prime Minister of Pakistan, Mr. Imran Khan. I didn't Imran Khan, ka nahi suna, but Mr. Tayyip Ertagan said that <laughs> the President of the president of France, he is mentally ill and he needs some kind of treatment. So, the people of France, France government, they are so angry, so angry that he asked the ambassador of France to get back from Turkey. I mean, you are saying that there is no liberty of speech. You can say anything, you can say anything against anyone, 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 you can say anything against anyone. But when Mr. Tayyip Ertagan said something against the president of president of France उनको गुस्सा आ गया कि भाई हमारे गेस्ट कैसे बोला आप जो इतने बड़े मुसलमान कम्युनिटी के साथ उनके दिलों के साथ खेल रहे हैं उनके अगेंस्ट कोई बात कर रहे हैं तो वो स्पीच की लिबर्टी नहीं है लेकिन आपके आप को कोई कुछ कह दे तो भाई मुसलमान मुसलमान तो फिर फसाद पसंद है मुसलमान तो चाहते ही तबाही है भाई ऐसा ही होना चाहिए था और ठीक हुआ बिल्कुल ठीक हुआ so the least we can do is to boycott the French products. Is we can do anything. What what can we do? Tell me. Suggest me in the comment section below. Okay, what can we do? Pakistan me bed ke, Saudi Arabia me bed ke, Turkey me bed ke. Ham kya kar sakte? The least we can do is to boycott the French products, and this is what we're doing. The people of various countries have decided to boycott the products of France. Which include Garnio. Garnio is the name of Garnio because it is the most popular. L'Oreal, I guess. It is the most popular. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the least we can do. Go for it. Start to buy card the French products. When you buy from someone or from a country, hit on the economy. This is the weakest point. And we can't do anything about this. Cover it. So, the economy will drop and they will realize that what they did. Muslim man se panga liya na. Ab dekho, dunya to chahe in loon ki ho jaye. Dunya to chahe kafiron ki ho jaye. Akhirat, Muslim manon ki hai. Aur dunya vaise bhi, is tarah khatam ho jaye ki, akhirat will stay forever. Ladies and gentlemen, let's pray ki Muslim man umat, phir se kathi ho jaye. Jho ghalat kar rahe hai, Islam ke naam pe, unhe samaj aajay ki wo ghalat hai. Khair, it's another topic and we'll talk about this. 
some other time. Jazakallah for being here. Jazakallah for listening to me. I have never done anything like this before. I'm sorry. I've been told in a lot of emergency. So, Jazakallah for being here. May Allah be with us all. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you're new here. Assalamu alaikum. And if you're on Instagram, then go up and follow. Assalamu alaikum.